If there are four steps uh, for digitalization and digital strategy, I would recommend, first of all, digital literacy. I think it's important for every key decision maker in the organization, from board to executives to managers, to understand what is this, what we call digitalization, digital transformation? What are the key technologies at play? And why are they important for you to, to understand them, to keep them in mind as something that is not going to go away, it's, it's gonna be pervasive, and the technology imperative is driving a lot of these things. So digital literacy, again, is important. Secondly, it's quite important for you to understand your business model. If you don't understand your business model, meaning how are you creating value? Who is your, your customer and why are they engaging with you? What is the experience that you are attempting to bring or the services and the engagement level that you are looking forward to achieve? If that understanding is not there, you know, your capabilities, the processes that are already in place for that particular area that you want to bring digitalization, then it will be a failure because if you don't understand what you are today, it's going to be extremely difficult for you to bring some degree of, of digitalization for the future. So starting with an assessment and, and understanding your value model and your business model will allow you to be more innovative in the future. Number three, it's important to have a roadmap and a strategic roadmap. Uh, and for that, you may need some assistance, you may need some help. Most or managers and organizations that I have seen and people who are attempting to bring the digitalization, even executives, they come from the operational background. That doesn't mean that they cannot do a strategy, but most of them are extremely good operationally, but that is a framework, their ways of evaluating current state and future state is hardwired from an operational perspective, which is great, for performance and, and getting things done in terms of operational activities from a tactical level, when it comes to a strategy, then you need a, a more comprehensive view. You need to remove yourself from, from that level of tacticality into a more broad view of all the dependencies and the pieces that are involved. So get help from um, members in your team that perhaps have that background. Uh, get perhaps organizations that are many boutique level consulting firms that can help you just to strategize what is the roadmap, what are the steps to get there, what are the tests that you have to perform so you can you can move ahead in, in the process of evaluating what are the best approaches for digitalization for that team that you have. And finally, um, make sure that you, you have a, a long-term view for this. Digitalization and digital strategy and digital transformation is a long-term approach. It should be embedded and ingrained into the organization as part of the fiber of the organization, and that takes time. Um, most people are hired, rewarded, and promoted based on costs and tactical operational activities. Very seldom it is based on strategic thinking or visualization of what the future should look like or creating new ways of engaging customers um, based on trends that are relatively new to the organization. So be open to that and be open to the fact that there's going to be failures and you need to set up a process to learn from those failures and apply that learning into your own processing within the organization for digitalization. So you can not only learn as, as a team, but also create better experiences for your clients, for your employees, for your partners. These are the key elements that I have seen and over the next few days, I wanna be sharing some more details about my experiences with digitalization. And I hope this, um, these four steps can be of help to you as you think about the process of including more digital transformation, more digital strategy into your personal, professional career, your team, and your organization. Until next time, cheers.